Hey girlies, it's Tammy. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are doing something completely different. I saw these on AliExpress and I decided to just grab them because they were super cheap. Plus I've been really like into liquid eyeshadows lately. Ever since I saw Colourpop release liquid eyeshadows and I literally cannot get my hands on them, I've been on the hunt for a alternative. So I came across these and they were £1.95 from AliExpress and they are liquid glittery eyeshadows, but they also say you can use it on your lips. I didn't buy it for that purpose purpose but I suppose if you wanted to you can. So I picked up three shades. I got the shade 20 which looks like kind of like a brownish colour but with tons of different colours glitter in it. So once you open it up it does come with a doe foot applicator and I'm just going to swatch it for you guys. Let me do it in front of your face. Uh, it's not the most pigmented thing but it is just a liquid glitter. There's like a slight brown colour to it but majority is glitter and do you know what I'm not mad at it. For £1.95 it is glittery and I think it would be a nice eyeshadow topper. Next I picked up the shade 11 which is the one I'm most likely going to use today because it will go with my eye look and it is like a gold but they all have different colour glitters inside so they have like purple, green, silver glitter, tons of different colour glitters which is really really nice so let's go ahead and give this colour a swatch. I feel like this one has slightly more colour than the first one, it is like a yellowy gold so there it is swatched it has a really gorgeous reflection i really hope these will perform on the eyes yeah so the last one is shade 23 and it is like a reddish cranberry shade this one is appealing to me the most but it just won't go with my eye look today but let's go ahead and give it a swatch this is like christmasy it has a gorgeous reddish tone but it also of course has the glitter to it now I did already swatch these on my hands earlier just to see if my skin would have any reaction um, and it didn't so it's all good to go for me but definitely give it a go on your skin before you put it on your eyes guys. They are from AliExpress and I'm not saying anything from AliExpress is you know bad but you never know so just give it a test before you put it on so here we have the swatches and they look really really pretty um i feel like this one up here the first one is the most sheerest and then the other two have really nice pigmentation to it in terms of color underneath the glitter I'm going to go with this one on my lid today to see if it can vamp up my look that I have going on right now. And if you do want a tutorial for this look, it is over on the Makeup Revolution YouTube channel. I will link it down below. So let's go ahead and try this. I'm going in with number 11 and they say you can just use the doe foot applicator and apply it straight to your lid. Or they say if you want a more precise application, then use a brush. I'm going to try use the applicator first and see how we go. So I'm literally just going to start painting this on. It looks okay, it's adding a little bit more colour, I need to get a closer mirror. Yeah, it's definitely adding glitter and a little bit of golden colour, so I'm just going to go in with another layer. Oh yeah, I love this. Oh, I love this. It's literally like a liquid glittery eyeshadow. It actually reminds me of the Stila things. I don't know what they're called, but that Stila thing. Um, the glitter is not popping as much as I thought it would, but maybe it has to dry down first for the glitter to come out. But so far, I'm loving that. The yellow is definitely showing up. It is there. It is saying, hey, and I'm really liking this. So I'm going to do this eye now. Okay, so I'm loving that so far. I'm just going to wait for it to dry or should I blend the edges first? Ooh. I'm just going to take the eyeshadow that I was using and kind of blend the edges. See if it blends well. No, it's kind of dried down. Wait, let me get close. Oh yeah, it's blending slightly, but I feel like I should have done it while it was wet. Because now I've got like that line. So I'm going to apply a little bit on the edge and then I'm going to use my finger to kind of blend that in. So I'm just going to use my finger and kind of tap over it and see if it will blend. Oh yeah, that's gorgeous. It blends if you just tap over the edges while it is still wet. Don't wait till it dries. Okay, so what I'm noticing is if you try and build the wet on top of the dry, it kind of starts to look at that separate. So you want to make sure you work with the whole eyeshadow while it's wet. 
now I've messed up a little bit. I didn't know you couldn't put another layer on top of already dry layer, so I now know that for next time. Okay, so here we are close up. Excuse this eye because like I said, I did mess up. That was my fault trying to build a wet one on top of an already dry layer. But this eye has come out perfect. I really do like how it is looking. It is blended, it's glittery, it is gorgeous. Okay guys, let me give you my thoughts on these AliExpress liquid eyeshadows. I definitely say if you are interested, go for it. If you've been looking at the Colourpop ones thinking, hey, I want a little sparkly eyeshadow thing. This is definitely a good kind of dupe. I love that the glitters in there are green and purple and yellow and they have all different types of glitters in every single shade. They do have more colours than this. These are just the three that I personally wanted to pick up. I can't wait to use the other two shades. I'll probably incorporate this reddish tone into a tutorial sometime soon. But overall, I definitely recommend these. Just don't do what I did. Don't try build a wet layer on top of an already dry layer so try work with it all while it's still wet so blend it while it's wet apply another layer while it's wet and then once it dries don't play around with it because then it will come out like this and it looks really really nice and cute i hope you have enjoyed this video and found it helpful i will leave all of the links linked in my description box down below please go ahead and give me a thumbs up please subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll catch you guys in my next video take care bye